right, so I'm Eric Eyes, Kimei Karate. We've got a single hand here he's grabbing. We've got this little bit of a yank. So normally you're trying to get me off balance before he shoots into this cross guard here. Boom. So if we get to this position where we're stuck, there's different things we want to do. We want to react to this before they make this connection here. Same, so go ahead and make that connection again. Yeah. So he gets it locked in, my, my foot's stuck, all right? So as he's shooting out, or actually he's opening up here a little bit, as he's shooting in, I can brace myself here, and I want to get this here foot out of there as fast as I can. So I want to kind of end up in a position more like this, like sprawling, right? Now he's got my leg here with his bottom leg, right? But I'm, I'm sprawling as best I can to maintain my position, keep my balance in. All right, so here, he's still got this, this control. He's got a sleeve control here. All right, what we're gonna do is gonna use this karate term. We're gonna do make Kensetsu Gary, our, our stamping kick with our back leg here. So it's gonna look something like this. I'm gonna come over top, and I'm gonna kick this leg out, right? When I do that, I'm just gonna chamber. I'm just gonna chamber my right hand. So I'm gonna come out like this, I'm gonna go, shoo, I'm gonna chamber, I'm gonna slide right in here into this Kevin Tommy side control. When I do that, I'm pulling out, I'm really kind of using his grasp to trap his own arm here like this. I step over the top, I pull this here arm out from his grasp, and I'm sliding over the top, and I'm laying down over the top of here. I really want to make this connection, my elbow and his hip, on the opposite side is my hip. So I'm kind of vice gripping here between my elbow, my tricep, and my hip on the far side, all right? You gotta have a nice base over here, all right? This leg is gonna lay flat, and I might even turn my foot up like this. I don't want necessarily a dead leg, but I'm just gonna be here in position, all right? With my elbow in, underneath his shoulder, grabbing onto that shoulder, all right? So typically from this position, he's doing a good job of controlling his arm, all right? He's not really extending out. If he extends out, that's fine, all right? If he doesn't, that's fine too. Grabbing that shoulder. Big push from here, and I'm gonna step up to my knee. I'm gonna give it a little bit of a pull. So big push, step, pull, all right? So, so can you come right over here? I just wanna see this, all right? So when he is controlling this, he's got really good self-discipline, he's not pushing away, he's not really giving me anything from here, so there's a chance I might lose this. I'm gonna take this here, I'm gonna swim it through like this. And now I've got the arm, I've hooked the arm now. Where before it was like this, and I don't really have anything. I take it, I pull him up on that shoulder, sliding it through, all right? We're gonna end up here back behind the shoulder, I'm deltoid of the tricep. All right, and now I'm just gonna make this transition down around. I step behind him, I'm gonna pivot to my foot. Step, foot, and I sit back. This connection, I like to make it right here, all right? So I'm putting my hand on my thigh, I'm sitting back with it, squeezing my knees, squeezing my feet. I'm actually lifting him in, and now from here, I'm just gonna circle this, hook this, and sit right back with this arm bar, and I can adjust to make sure I get this submission, okay? From here, I'm just gonna let go, I'm gonna tuck or hook my foot underneath that shoulder, I'm just gonna push him away from it. All right, from that roll up, we can finish here up on our right knee, left knee is up, and we're just gonna do a little bow just like so, okay? So nice little uh, flow drill from this here lapel cross guard. So I'm gonna do it one more time. Grab him, tug, 